in a comfortable laning matchup where he'll get pressured by the Lulu, but kill pressure is quite low. Freaker have a really nice draft, and let's see how the Gragas priority. 2-0 here, 1-6. What a world we live in. Oh, well, this could be a really good start here for SKT. Getting that flash from Songy. The exhaust comes out onto Snowflower. They get the stun. Flash already down here. Has to use the heal as well to try to keep himself alive. Mickey comes in with a gold card. Maybe Africa can turn this one around as all five members. members are here. He gets slowed out by the Ren, and he goes down. They have the Callista Ren secure and Smite available, so probably going to be academic stuff for Africa. Yeah. You see that does get taken away now. Yep, the dash coming through from Duke. Gets knocked back. Has to flash over the wall, but that's going to be two people chasing over the wall as well. Ixu looking like he's going to go down. No mana, grand challenge just for safety. And he is going to fall. <laughs> Shield, he's just delaying this as long as possible, but Duke will inevitably get that kill. Now we'll be by Blank, who has to body slam into that. He throws out the barrel. Brent comes through, and that's the second dragon of the game going over to Afrika. 13. Going to stick around in this bot side, shoving this wave as much as possible. Duke. Dueling onto Ixu here. He dashes forward on the wolf, tries to get underneath the tower, boots away the Fiora. TP comes in from Faker though. Ixu stunned into the wall with a cask, and that's going to be a kill coming in for Blank actually. Faker not able to take that one away. But now two. Oh, open. As oh, Destiny go. comes through. Faker gets stunned up by the gold cards. A huge amount of damage from that Twisted Fate coming out. Flash over the wall here by Snowflower. Face call comes in, pops up three members, and <laughs> Africa are looking to wipe the floor with SKT. Snowflower is still tanking up the front side. Gets stunned up by the concussive blows. Lira though with the red buff. Can he find the Kill on the wolf, throws out the Q, isn't enough, Blank has to flash away, flash forward, the auto attack, finds the kill. As SKT2 trying to force up onto this tower, but the TP's coming in from Ixu on the sidelines, no home guards of course, not yet, 20 minutes, goes in, stuns Faker onto the traffic cone however, we are going deep, will get locked up, looks like he's going to go down, Duke finding that kill, and now it's just Songyun trying to kite back as fast as possible and slow him up if he can, Ixu charges up the ultimate, throws it out, knocks away the Fiora, but to what avail, it looks like the rest of Africa just going to go down, Faker finding the kill, a double kill now as he takes down both Mickey and off of the Dragon. Dragon. Moving forward here, Ixu getting slowed up. Nice traffic cone to deny that dash forward by Duke, but he's still going in. Grand challenge down onto Ixu. is popped up by the Wild Growth, and he's just going to fall. And just like that, Lyra, the calling coming across. They dive in. Lyra trying to dash away. Explosive cast comes in. Fate's call goes out. They want to throw him back in. So far, it goes in. Baker really low. Gets stunned up. Wild Growth already used. Ton of damage coming through. Poppy knockup. Baker is going to go down. Lyra finds that. Just like that, Africa going to net themselves their third dragon. Explosive cast unable to seal it away. The smite comes through. His team looks very strong. Rock Tigers have shown what Lulu and Fiora can do. And speaking of Fiora, she's coming in. Yeah, coming in from above. And Song Yun right in the forefront here. Going to have to be careful. Snowflower, nice shield there by Ixu to deny the dash through. But Duke just going to throw down the Grand Challenge on the Snowflower. Here comes the TP from Mickey. Let's see if he can do anything. Draws the gold card. TP coming in above as well from Faker. Traffic Cone to zone him off. And this is going to be Afrika trying to dash away. Mickey gets engaged on by that flash body slam. Slowed out by the spooky ghost as Ixu. shoot. Ixu. The Q lands, gold card goes out, stuns up Blank. Ixu still trying to take the brunt of this damage. Oh. Snowflower goes in, has to flash away, but he's going to go down. Really questionable fate's call right there. And now Afrika are scrambling to get out. Does, but uh, Blank is there to interrupt. There's the explosive cast. So he's not going to be able to get it. He's going to go down. The question is, who gets the kill? Looks like it might just be Faker, and it is. And with that pick, that could be the inspiration. They get more picks now. Yeah, they're actually just collapsing in on this midside. Songyun all off on his lonesome. Look at that damage. Pops the heal, but it doesn't even matter. Duke just melts him out. Lyra needs a miraculous steal here. Throws out the smoke screen, trying to clear out this vision. Double teleport, it's yeah. gonna be 5v5. The TP is coming in here. Baron only below half HP. Actually, looks like SKT is gonna have to peel off this wolf. He's gonna eat that gold card. Bank, bank dashing forward here. Takes a bit of damage. Lyra, though, on the exchange, taking a hell of a lot more. Has to dash away. Mickey on the sidelines. Has to pop the Zonias, but all five members crawling on top of him. He goes down. Duke finds that kill, I believe, his fifth of the game. And SK fight again. We need to scale more. The big thing is that SKT with double teleport on their soul laners, both of them available, could shop, come to the fight, rush to that inhibitor quick enough. Yeah, I'm not sure what he wants to do. Pops the destiny Looking here. For back He's going to go straight for the inhibitor, so he's going to trade inhibitors, but what can SKT also get off of this push? It is the big question. They're trying to keep him contained in the base. The recall coming through. Mickey doing what he can. TP's burned out, though. And it looks like Mickey's just going to have to use his teleport to get out. But a nice wild growth by Faker interrupts it at the last second. See a hero play. You'd have to get in there quick. May not even get a chance. Yeah, he's just clearing out some vision. Just going to go ahead and back off since, you know what, it's not worth it. And Baron goes over to SKT, who now have a 5.3. They have no option. Only really the Graves ult 
is probably going to clear out this minion. They can't do it. Yeah, that's going to be the tower going down. Lyra has to flash away. Explosive cast not really going to hit anybody, but it might not matter. It's going to be the gold card coming through. Meanwhile, Duke has completely solo killed Ixu. Songin finds the kill onto Blank. It'll be a slight little reprieve here, but it looks like they're going to lose all three inhibitors off of this push. And I don't think there's going to be any coming back from this, especially with the super creeps coming into the mid wave. Baron and Power, Nexus Tower already down below half HP. It's do or die time for Mifrika, and I think it's going to be the latter. It's looking like the dying. They have to go for a 4v4. There is no way to defend three inhibitors down. Traffic Cone comes out. That's going to be collateral damage. They throw Snowflower in. Wolf is going to fall. Duke falls as well. His first death of the game. Massive shutdown here for Songyun. Can they get onto Faker? Flash is available should he have to use it, but Mickey comes around the back side. Fights Bang. He goes down. This could actually be an ace for Afrika if they can get the chase. Snowflower with the chase over the wall. It was at the cone, but Faker is just a little bit just yet. It's just not enough. They also didn't get all the summoners, so Bang will have a flash in his next fight. Wolf will as well. Duke dies with his summoners available. Bottom side. Inhibitor has respawned in the mid, but Duke should be able to finish this one off. Bang not quite going to get stunned into the wall there by Ixu. Inhibitor goes down on the bot side. Let's see what a Freak of Freaks can do. This is really SK Telecom's game to lose at the moment. It's going to be Destiny Pop. Blank gets stunned into the wall by Ixu, but he's taking a hell of a lot of damage. Mickey comes around the backside, finds Bank. That's going to be the Wildgrove coming through, and Mickey goes down. Bank's still alive, trying to lifesteal as much as he possibly can. He Song does Yoon. fall. Songyun going off here, finding himself a double kill. Can he get more? It's just going to be Duke and Faker standing. They're on him. He's Polymorph. He goes down. Snowflower is going to fall. That's going to be the ace for SK Telecom. That's going to be the game, and we are going to game three. That was Duke there. He actually reposted, got the stun onto the Callista, took him down. Duke was set up to succeed, and boy did he ever. 7-1-6, and 8-1-7, and seven. welcome return by Faker, and we're going to a game three. Yeah, and that was uh, quite the turnaround. We looked like SKT just completely scrambling for that, that first game. This time, coming to the game two, really looking like the team that we saw at IEM.